Happy Friday, my friends. Can you believe it's the last weekend of summer? It's Labor Day weekend. And I really appreciate everyone that sends over content, emails, DMs. I got one from Jim yesterday evening, and he mentioned that Arkansas football was uh, below the $250 season ticket price. So essentially, you can go on StubHub, you can go on Vivid and buy tickets for each game cheaper than the $250 season ticket price point. And you know, guys, I was going to bore you to death and show you the data from StubHub from their primary, but you know what? Screw it. I mean, I'm just so, so like mind boggled by the incompetency in college athletics. And I don't want to hear excuses. I don't want to hear that it's COVID. I don't want to hear about the Delta variant affecting sales. This has been going on for the last five plus years of college athletic departments hiring incompetent people, crashing their market, undercutting their season ticket holders, being like Steve Cohn from the New York Mets. And this is just an absolute joke. Why buy season tickets? Why donate to the university? Why, if you can buy a $6 ticket on StubHub, why just don't do that every single game? Or buy a $12 ticket in the lower bowl? Like, it's just an absolute joke. And I would love a college administrator to challenge me on this because it's going, it's happening in like 80% of the par five schools. Yes. 20% of them are, have a good ticketing ecosystem, but the other 80% is a complete joke. Like why are we buying full price tickets? Why are you undercutting your season ticket holders? And don't give me about high, low, medium demand. I don't care. It's a joke. It's an absolute joke. And I'm going to end it there because I want to enjoy my Labor Day weekend. I want to keep it lean and clean. And we have amazing things on the horizon. It's got podcasters. We have another verbal confirmed guest that you guys are going to love. We got Tony Knopp, CEO, ticket manager, coming on next week. We got Rosh Hashanah on Monday. Producer Mike Fish, I'm going to be eating apples and honey for a sweet new year. And enough rants for the day. Have a fantastic Labor Day weekend. And you guys know, keep it lean and clean.